Hey, let's do it. God damn, that was loud as sh. Why was that so loud? Damn, dude really took their whole damn window out. That's crazy. Holy sh. He was not playing around. Even knocked down the door. Holy hell. I pop out with Glock I pop out with killers, bitch. You know that we Glock Hey, man. Y'all see what the f*** going on. It's your boy, Peach. We back at it. Today, we're playing Tech Store Simulator, episode number two. Real quick before we get started, if you guys are new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Also, turn on bell notifications. That way, anytime I upload a video, you guys will be notified. To all my returning subscribers, welcome back. So glad to have you guys here. Thanks so much for coming out to watch the videos. It's always greatly appreciated. One more thing, if you're interested in joining my Discord server, you can go down to the description of the video and find the link there. All you gotta do is click on it. It'll redirect you to Discord. And then after that, all you gotta do is press join and you should be in. Everyone's welcome to join, so feel free to do that if you're interested. Other than that, we're gonna get right to it. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. So last time we were playing this, we made it up to level 10. We left ourselves with $88. We did end up doing an expansion to our shop. You guys didn't see the space behind these shelves. The space between this wall and this wall right here it expanded out, gave us a little more room. We'll move these shelves down closer to the wall, get them as close as we can. And just like that, we got our shelves moved over. So we do have new items that we have to unlock. And then I also do wanna get some more shelves i think having a shelf for each individual product is the way that we're gonna go there's 12 products overall that we have currently we will be able to buy more along down the line we just got to buy the product licenses we just have to level up and then pay for all these new companies to get all this new product so we're gonna need 12 shelves total we have four we're gonna get started and open up shops so we can get customers coming in as fast as we can Now that we sold a couple items and got our money up a little bit, we'll go ahead and buy our next phone case. So something I noticed across the street from us, we have another tech store. If we come in here, you guys can see there's all kinds of different products that they have. It's a pretty big space inside of here. I think this is potentially what we can work up towards and make our shop look like at some point. But I figured I'd show you guys that. We just got a notification that says we got a new email. We'll go check that out. We got an email from Exta Wetter 78 Tempting recovery protocol. Error the recovery process cannot be completed. Oh, okay. I don't know about all that so i've been seeing this guy walking around out here he has an explanation point above his head it says we can talk to him let's see what he says need a hand hey i see you got some shiny new competition over there funny thing that place used to be my turf had a supermarket called knock the market right there yeah those slick suits came in kicked me out and set up their tech toy shop now if you want to give the jerks across the street a hard time i'm your guy but hey, this ain't charity. Fork over 50 bucks to kick things off and I'll start cooking up some plans to make their lives a living hell. Sound good? Shit, sounds good to me, my dude. You do your thing. Here's that $50 you needed. Hopefully that way, get more customers to come in. You're out of the heart phone cases. We'll go order some more of those. So I wonder what that dude's gonna be doing. Is he just gonna be hanging out over there? Did you guys just see that? Did he just eat that person? Oh, what the hell? All right, that must be the spawn in point, apparently. Looks like we just got another email. We'll go check that. The group of British scientists recently found that listening to songs where cats meow increases productivity by 42%. We recommend turning it on full blast and checking it out for yourself. But be aware your employees might start purring. And then next we have the product of the day. It says the product of the day is the blood orus. It looks like it appears to be a mouse. And it looks like we have enough to buy some more chargers so let's see this is 144 we'll add this to our card for the screen protector so we just hit 200 dollars. i think i'm gonna buy this mouse leaving us with two dollars left over i've had quite a bit of people come in asking for it and we haven't had it so i think what i'm gonna do is put this on the shelf and see what happens and we almost got our shelf stocked back up we just got one item down the bottom that we can fill up and then i think once we get to that point we'll let some of these go down and then we'll start saving up for the next shelf i believe we got another email we'll go check that out did you know that after five years of use your monitor may be going through a midlife crisis they may start showing sad wallpapers and wondering about the meaning of pixels support it through the tough times by playing your favorite movies and changing the wallpaper more often wow i would have never known there's a 400 dollars mark we'll go back to the shop and purchase ourselves another shelf right next to the other ones just like so so we have 136 dollars we'll buy some of the smooth surface elite screen protectors so we do need to buy the short chargers you know that's something we've needed for a while we got an email from unknown it says sell garage okay i don't know what that's supposed to mean computer mice have begun to show signs of independence some of them have stopped responding to clicks others are suddenly moving on their own this could be part of their plan to take over the office if your mouse has started behaving strangely it may have already joined the ranks of the rebels it needs to be replaced sheesh now we gotta look out for the mice it's crazy there's four hundred dollars you guys already know that that's grounds for a new shelf another one added to our collection so i haven't ordered this case yet the defender max we'll give that a go the meteorite is going to hit the earth tonight run for your lives oh well 
Damn, that group of customers bought a lot of shit. Let's go talk to our dude across the street, see how he's doing. Camp out chaos. So you want to even the playing field a bit, huh? For just 250 bucks, I can make that happen. Here's the deal. I'll set up camp right in front of that shiny store across the street. Me and my uh, unique scent will keep their customers away like flies from a fire. Trust me, once I'm done, you'll be seeing a 20% boost in your own foot traffic. Deal? Shit, that sounds like a pretty good deal. 20% foot traffic going up? We gotta get $250. So we're up to 386. We'll go find our dude real quick. Go pay him his 250. <laughs> Look at him. He's just posted up. He's just hanging out, stretching out, laying on the corner of the building and shit. On the streets, a homeless man decided to organize a riot after he wasn't sold the phone at a 99% discount. The city resident stands at the door of the store and scares the visitors with a scent. Residents of the street asked the police to intervene, but they were not given the discount either. <laughs> <laughs> that's so funny it looks like he's saying like up yours with his arms that's even better hey that 250 was worth it though so we need more of the hard phone cases and then we need more of the screen protectors we'll order those that's so funny he's just chilling there he don't give a shit he's just hanging out scientists found out from the monitor increases the desire to buy a new computer by 35 percent dear friends the latest neuromarketing marketing research proves that regular <clears throat> exercise in front of the monitor can dramatically increase the desire to upgrade your pc check it out for yourself and order a newest ultra gamer pc at 50 percent off damn they're coming in here clearing the shelves out like crazy holy shit There's most of our stuff restocked. We still got customers constantly coming in, so we're always battling against that, trying to keep our shelves stocked up. But hey, I ain't complaining when they all stack up, because you can go through them really quick, and that stacks our money up pretty quick. I mean, I'm already back up to $521. Looks like we got our dude hanging out over here. He's not laying on the corner of the store across the street anymore. We'll talk to him again. Rock and roll, window edition. You know, things are going good, but we can do better. How about we throw a little surprise party? And by party, I mean I'll chuck a nice big rock through their window. Glass everywhere. Customers scared out of their wits. They'll be running into your shop in no time just another 500 bucks and watch your sales store and you in hey let's do it god damn that was loud as shit why was that so loud damn dude really took their whole damn window out that's crazy holy shit he was not playing around even knocked down the door holy hell oh my gosh he destroyed it in here holy shit dude was not playing appreciate you my boy man went a little off the hinges there but hey if that's the price you got to pay to get customers in the store i ain't gonna complain all right so back to ordering some more of the things that we need We'll order these four things. Man, he wasn't kidding when the foot traffic was going to increase in here. Holy shit. Oh my god, that was so many customers. Damn, they almost cleared out the whole shelves too. Okay, I think what I want to do is order everything we need right now one more time. And then hopefully by then we should have enough. I want to buy the storage section just to expand our store a little farther. Just like that, we have our shelves fully stocked, filled to the brim. Now that we're done with that, we'll open the shop back up and then wait until we get to that thousand dollar mark and then we'll unlock the storage. And just like that, we literally hit a thousand dollars right on the mark. So we'll go to the manager tab, go to storage, and then we'll hit one rack for a thousand. Purchase that. So now we'll come over here. You guys can see it's open up in our storage room. We got one shelf right here. I wonder what it looks like from the outside. Wait, so it looks the same on the outside, but it's expanded on the inside. So we'll take care of these last batch of customers really quick. We'll deal with these last two customers and then we'll close up shop. And I think this is going to be a good place to end off this episode. We grinded it out quite a bit. We ended up with two more shelves and we also ended up unlocking the storage room. We have a shelf right here. And we also did make it up to level 21. We're leaving off the $565. I think in the next episode I want to look towards hiring a cashier. And you can also hire somebody to stock the items as well. But I think that's going to do it for today's episode. If you guys enjoyed the video make sure you leave a like. Also leave a comment down below. Don't forget to if you haven't subscribed subscribe make sure you do that also if you're looking into joining my discord don't forget the link is down in the description feel free to go join that if you're interested other than that guys i'm out of here thanks so much for watching i'll see you in the next one Yo, what is up with these people sliding damn that dude's pissed he's so mad he can't even walk he just has to slide and apparently he can't make it around the fence you okay my guy you having a mental breakdown man standing out there by the fence talking about oh can i get a refund looking at oh my gosh guys look at this this is actually insane i cannot believe we were playing knocked down totem on a literal web browser page this is actually nuts and the map it looks good too the movement it's pretty smooth it's kind of a little buggy here and there, but I mean, what do you expect? It's literally from a web browser. Like, come on now. Hey, Zach, go down to that hole. Yeah, go down to that <laughs> hole. That's promising. I ain't going down shit. Come on, bro.
take a dirt nap. <laughs> <laughs> you tripping, folks? Who is this shit at? Oh my god! Go Don't go in the fucking cave! Finally, someone agrees with Don't me. Let's put on in the cave. cave. Don't go in the cave. Go in the cave if you want to die. That's all I got. Bro, what? What? They literally folded my shit, bruh. Come on.